your state, what is the first food that comes to mind? Well, is it ribs, chicken, or maybe even moon pies or something like that? Well, for a lot of people, that answer, well, at least for the people from Memphis, that answer is a no-brainer, barbecue ribs. But when you start asking folks across the state that same question, you might get a whole host of answers. Joining us this morning to tell us why we should all come together on the answer is our favorite, <laughs> our pal. He is a social media star, Memphis native, and of course, a chef. Logan, <laughs> how are you? Oh, I'm Good doing all. great. Good to see you. This is yeah. so exciting, man. All right, so today I brought you some of the uh, choices or yes. the candidates. Okay. But we all know the real winner is ribs. Thank you. So, got to root for the home team here, Memphis Absolutely. ribs. Absolutely. Hands down, the winner. Absolutely. But, uh, we also have Nashville hot chicken here, which you know, is a good contender, but I really, I really don't think so. I don't think so. I, don't think I mean, so I, but I have heard your hot chicken is delicious. Yeah. I mean, I'm just going to take a little bitty bite here, okay? Yeah. And I've heard yeah, it. It might be too hot. I mean, I didn't bring any water. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Yeah, before he, before, oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. All it's right. pretty hot. So, uh, mm. yeah, yeah, that's hot chicken. It's pretty good. And uh, then I also have some moon pies over there. We need a, we need a little graphic that has spice uh, fire <laughs> coming out of my head. Oh my gosh. Oh man, I, did, I didn't think you'd actually take a bite. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I have to try it. Okay, <laughs> so. <laughs> all right, so. Uh, um, <laughs> hot, hot, hot. hot, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, hot, hot chicken, very, <laughs> very hot. <gasps> now, uh, we also have moon pies, which are actually from Chattanooga, and they've been making okay. them for over 100 years. And. Uh, Bless my heart and soul, I need some water here. Oh my gosh. Tell us about this event. <laughs> All right, so uh, the event is actually taking place in uh, St. Louis, so not too big of a drive. Okay. And uh, it's actually going on from October like 27th, 28th, around then. And. Uh... <laughs> oh my goodness, Chef. Oh man. Wow. <laughs> okay. That moment when your hot chicken's too hot. So, uh, we also have some pork rinds over here, but, you know, that's not as good as ribs. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, my hot chicken was way too hot. Oh my gosh, honey, it's okay. <laughs> hey, I didn't realize it would take my breath like that. It's good. I just need some water. Now, this is an event in St. Louis. Tell us yep. about it. So, it's really cool because they're actually going to host uh, all the state dishes from 50 states. Okay. So, every state dish is going to be represented. So, like, Hawaiian poke, uh, whatever Tennessee turns out to be. And then there's, we like... we don't have a state dish, right? No, we don't. Is that kind of bizarre to it you? It is. It is kind of weird because we kind of need to pick one. Yeah. So, we... And you're rooting for the ribs. I'm rooting for the ribs. Definitely got to root so for too. the home team. I mean, after I taste the hot chicken, I think I'm definitely <laughs> in a contending class for the ribs. So what can we do to join the Flavored Nation and, and get Tennessee in there? Well, you can definitely always talk on social media, and you can also uh, try and hunt down whatever state representative. Uh, I've, I've hunted down the, the governor, and he said to go talk to somebody else. And um, so we can hunt those guys down and kind of message them about, you know, where ribs should be at. Yes, I agree. And, and you, you have been called to this mission. Yep. And it's a very prestigious deal because it's never been done before, yep, right? This is the first time they're ever going to host all the state dishes under one roof. Wow. And it's going to be really incredible to go there and see them all. And... Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll oh be at gosh. the festival and, you know, you okay. yeah, I'll be trying all I'm so them. sorry. I've thrown him off totally because I'm sitting here coughing like a crazy woman. <laughs> and I like hot <laughs> stuff. I just want to let you know, it's not your chicken. It just got me a little, it went down the wrong pipe there. Now, you can also meet Chef Logan at his book signing from this Saturday from 2 to 4, right? That's right, going to be definitely. a fun one. Yeah, it should be a lot of fun. I'll be doing a book signing. I'll be doing some recipe demonstration. Okay. I'll be having just a wonderful time. Big blast. And, uh... Uh, yeah, God. I'm sorry about that hot no, chicken. Honey, it's not your fault. I mean, hot stuff does that to me. My husband will tell you. I just should have had a whole gallon of water here to help me. Whoop. Okay, so one more time because my coughing lost it. Okay. It is a new show, yeah. and they are they brought you in to help mm -hmm. promote yeah. it, and we want to write our state legislators, our lawmakers, to let them know we need a state dish. Yep. We're backing Chef Logan, and we want it to be... Ribs. Ribs. Because That's the one cook, that we want. You cook everything yeah, great. I mean, but ri ribs are really what it should be. I mean, yeah. we, we shouldn't be doing uh, something like like a hot moon chicken pies. or moon pies. I mean, no, go no. with the ribs. Yeah, absolutely. And these, by the way, one reason, I mean, I love me a moon pie, but come on. Now, have these shrunk in the dryer? Steve Green, are these like they used to be when we were kids? No, they used to be this big. So that I'm voting for these. Definitely. <laughs> oh, gosh, I 
almost ate that too. <laughs> Thank okay. you. you. Thank wanna, you so much. Should you toss a break or am I okay uh, to do that? Uh, I mean, uh, I, guess, uh, I guess you can go for it. <laughs> <laughs> it's afraid of me now. Hey, are you looking for a new table to sit at? 